tonight, hundreds of runners lacing up to show their support for officers that lost their lives in the line of duty. Joe Sam has the story. For many of us, going to work and not coming back home to our families is something we don't often think about. But for police officers, it's a concern that runs through their mind from the very second they clock in. It's not enough to honor these, the sacrifice these officers made just once a year, so this is just another way we do it throughout the year. The proceeds made from today's event will go back to help families deal with any finances and issues after losing their loved one. It's an event Lieutenant Weiner says has picked up over time. The last couple years it's kind of peaked. Uh, we lost Officer Steve Smith and some other officers recently uh, from other agencies that's generated a lot more interest. Officers are not only putting on this event to pay respect to those officers who have lost their lives in the line of duty, but also to pay respect to two very special women for one very special reason. Myself and the other officer have had a you know, tough year both being you know, diagnosed with breast cancer and dealing with all of the surgeries and treatments and ongoing treatments that you know, we still have to deal with. Aisha and the second honoree, Libby Hinkle, will be able to use funds to help with any further treatments. They had a huge turnout of support today with runners looking to give them both and all officers a message of thanks. I would just say thank you. I mean, they give their, they give their time and their lives for us and help protect us, so it's the least we can do to support them. In Columbus, Joe Sam, ABC 6 News.